Okay, this flower is really a very simple and easy one. We're going to start with a circle. I'm drawing it so you can see it. This is helpful for some people who can't conceptualize uh, the making the petals right off the top. So we're going to do a bullseye. Bam. Straight up. Across the center. And then we could actually go through that. And this is going to be our guide for our petals. So the tip of our petals would be on each one of these. So I'm going to start with my base here, and that's my tip. I'm working it as a clock. I'm now at 6 o'clock. 3 o'clock. 3 o'clock. So from here, all you need to do is erase those lines because we really don't need to see the mechanics of it. So we just go ahead and erase all of those lines. I'm going to use a deeper color and just trim on my line. Just follow the line. So now I can just, if I wanted to add an accent color to that, I can. So we're ready to go and press and pull once again. Same stroke. Incidentally, you can start in the middle. You don't have to start with the petals. right around. If you're using a light color paint, you're going to see those lines. So you really must either er erase them or make them lighter. We need our center, don't we? So let's go with our yellow, and I'm just going to start in the middle and push out. Now I'm going to trim it. I can trim it with gold or I can just trim it with my purple just to give it a stronger definition. Let's put some V's on this now. Of course, we're not going to see the bottom. Just doing it on the main flowers. We don't have to do it on all of them. I would just like that. Quickly put some leaves on it to give it some contrast. So we can get quite busy with our designs. Just remember when you're doing this, you want to sign your work, practice your signature. 